I'm an orientation and mobility specialist at Vision Services for the Blind and the PASS Coalition. I'm Maria Hansen. I'm president of Guide Dog Users of New York and a member of the PASS Steering Committee. We are here to teach how to use the accessible pedestrian signals in New York City. The accessible pedestrian signal, or APS, is a device that tells you when the walk light is on and it is safe to begin crossing. An APS is usually mounted on a pole near the crosswalk. It admits a beep at one second intervals so you can find its location. There is a raised arrow on the bottom part of the APS. This arrow tells you which crosswalk corresponds to the APS and the general direction of travel. Sometimes the arrow doesn't point precisely to the opposite corner, so it's important to listen to traffic sounds to establish alignment. Once the button is pushed, a voice says and continues to repeat the word until the walk interval begins. Then the push button vibrates and you hear a rapid tick or a voice say, the walk sign is on to cross. They're very reassuring. Sometimes it's so confusing uh, in New York. Uh, the volume of traffic, the trucks, the buses, uh, construction, uh, motorcycles, subways underground, it's really hard to sort out what direction vehicles are coming from sometimes. Also the arrows uh, to help with alignment. So I find that at confusing intersections, they're really a blessing. And I'd like to see a lot more of them in New York City. The APS is not a magic box. It doesn't stop cars from turning towards you. It doesn't give accurate alignment to cross the street. You must listen to traffic before crossing. The only purpose of the APS is to tell you the walk light is on. This is a production of the Computer Center for Visually Impaired People, Baruch College, City University of New York.